Hello people, my name is Horia and in this tutorial we're gonna install Xmin and for that we're gonna need to download it. We're just gonna google it and it's the first result unless you're using Bing for which you can find it on the fourth or fifth page. So after downloading it we're gonna install it of course. Everything is gonna be on default. And we're gonna launch it. We also need putty. I already have it downloaded, but you can download it from here. So I'm gonna start my virtual machine. And this virtual machine is uh, newly installed, so it doesn't have anything configured. So I'm gonna also show you what libraries to install in Linux so you can make, make Xming work. And until that happens, I'm gonna also configure the networking. I'm just gonna configure a port forwarding, so network, advanced, port forwarding. So I want to be able to go from my local host on Windows to the Linux guest host on port 22 here I'm just gonna log in and to be able to use Xmin we're gonna need the xos library And then we're gonna need a um, program to test it. So either xsize, xterm, xclock, either one of these, either one is fine. Ah, oh, sorry, forgot to do one thing. Because it's newly installed, it doesn't have the networking configured. So for that, I'm just gonna use DH client to get an IP address. So now I'm gonna install everything. So after the installation has finished, we're gonna configure Putin. For that, we're gonna go to 127.0.1. We're gonna create a new session, center 7. And we're gonna go to SSH, X11, and enable X11 forwarding, which is our X protocol. We're gonna save it and open it. We're gonna log in as root and we are gonna test the display. And here it is. This is how you install Xming and the X libraries on your Linux machine.